hi friends welcome to my channel from today we are going to learn about new series the angular 10 angular 10 already released and uh, these are using very much in software industry if you don't know anything about angular or you have not used any older version of angular so don't worry about that i will show you each and everything from scratch okay so angular dot io so this is the angular official website and you can get help from here also so before starting i want to confirm you one thing many of you have confused between angular js and angular so actually this is the google product and when angular first releases they started as angular js that was basically angular one and after that they faces many problems and modifies that version and make angular js to the angular framework so from angular 2 to up to today's version that is i will going to show you angular 10 the all the angular framework and we will going to learn about this angular framework only okay so before starting we need to know why we learn angular and what is the feature of angular it is the component based architecture that provides the higher quality of code as you know mpc framework always provides you better structure and better coding standard okay and obviously the performance is very high as it is mbc structure we can write a cleaner and less code with high scalability okay and another important thing is that this is a google product and google maintains this framework and it provides a long-term support from there and another thing is that this angular framework is open source and it is absolutely free so we don't need to buy this product we don't need to purchase any packages or something okay so there are some special packages if you want to use in your application so you can use your third party but the angular framework is absolutely free and we can use npm here we can use cdn here also some place we can use cdn and directly use it in your application but the best practice is npm 90 percent of person will use npm and i will show you why we use npm instead of cdn so in our upcoming video i will show you why we need to use npm instead of cdn so to get started with angular in this series we will going to learn about the basic understanding that is what is component what is template what is directory dependency injection and there are many things that is a routing navigation from HTTP clients and internationalization animations and there are lots of things and along with these we will learn about from handling and how to create API how to authorize to your application and we are going to learn step by step in our upcoming videos so if you like this video please like and subscribe this channel and you can share with your friends also and comment your opinion in the below comment section Thanks for watching this video. Have a good day.